Hey everybody, this is another Strat 101. This, vi this video is going to show you how to get started as a new coach in a league. And I'm going to actually do it with a new coach in our Strat Fam Form Retro League. Uh, his name is Eric. He hasn't played for quite a while, so we're going to uh, connect to his machine and go through the process on what you need to do. So I'm going to go ahead and do it for him on his machine. So what you're seeing here as I share my screen is viewer. Now, you don't need this to play, uh, but this is just for me to connect to his machine and kind of go through the process. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is figure out what your process is for your um, for your league. So for our league, we're going to go to the website. What I do as commissioner is I post the um, I post the files to the website every week. So we're going to go to in my case is hosted here. So each week you're going to go to the website. So bookmark it. Okay. So the first thing, step one, let's put a bookmark here. So you're going to download the league file. So that's step one. So we're going to save this and some commission file. There's no big deal. You just, um, you know, wherever you, wherever you save it. Now look at let's look at where it's saved here. So every week it's going to be saved at the same spot, the default spot for your computer. And in this case, in Eric's case, it's saved in the downloads directory. So there it is, 1989 SSRFL. So step one is going to be opening League Manager, and you're going to click League. then you're going to click restore league and you'll do that before you load your profile it's important that you do this step first number one um you can see the stats now this is week one league so you're not going to have any stats um but number two you need to do it before you load the profile because it will get wiped out so we're going to go to the quick access which will always have your downloads directory included so you're going to go double click on download select the league file and you say open or you could double click on it okay so this is the um restored league file for week one and the next step is you're going to go back to the website and you're going to download the pre-files now you only want to put and for the pre-files i have them zipped up week one pre-files fix.zip you can click open and then it'll download and open it right away and what you're going to do here is just take the pre-file for your team now let me uh, double check i'm pretty sure eric is eric is the the jets so we're just going to take the file for the jets so here's new york afc pre-file let's open this up so you can see the full name Come on. So 1989, New England Patriots at 1989, New York Jets. So we're going to take that file. We're going to copy it. Control-C or right-click and say copy. Then we're going to put it into the receive directory. Now, what I'm going to do for Eric is place that on his little favorites things here. So here's his, again, let's open this up so we can see football directory and here's his receive file now here's a cool little tip so you can right click here and you can say pin to quick access and what that will do is that that makes it so that every time that you want to uh, drop your pre-file in here it'll already be listed here so you go here 
and you're going to see a paste. Remember, we copied the pre-file. Okay, and now you're pretty much ready to play. I don't know if he's already done. What I like to do is pin the league manager and the strat football to the taskbar, so it'll always be there. So we'll do the same thing for his um, for his football icon. Strat football. We're going to go to the the um, stratomaticfootball.exe and we'll or let's change this to date modified as well everything's easier when you have it sorted there it is so stratomatic football we're going to right click on it and we're going to say pin to taskbar so now it'll always show up here okay so now we're going to start the game and you need to make sure that he make sure he's patched, which looks like he's he's applied the 2017 version F patch. And now, when you're ready to play your game, if you're the host, what you need to do is starting up. So you need to select the league file 1989 SSRFL. You need to click here, and then you're going to say launch new game server because the Jets are the home team today in the in week one. You're going to launch this, okay? Get really easy with the new setup. You're just going to give this number, 36331 in this case. You can change this to Eric. You're going to say okay, and then you're going to give that number to your opponent through Slack or whatever chatting client that you use and then um, uh, your opponent will open his game so I'm going to connect to him and you're going to now if you're just joining you just click join server and you use the number that your opponent gave you so here's 36331 I'm going to connect and Eric is the server sending team info and then you're ready to play. You have the coin toss, and you just start clicking away. So that's pretty much it. That's all you have to do. And then after the game, you need to go into the send directory. So Stratomatic Football, go down to go down to the send directory. Okay, so inside send, here it is. When you're finished with the game, inside send, a post file. Right now it says it's empty, but after your game, there will be a post file in here. So that's what you want to send to your commissioner, and you attach it in an email. So let's, let's go ahead and exit here. And that is the process. So let's just, the one thing I saw here, he has a league that's like empty. Let's, let's delete a league. I think there might be a blank league in here. Nope, that looks good. Okay, so let's go to the leagues folder because sometimes there'll be something in here that messes it up. Here, this is it. So League 12 is the one that's messed up. There's two League 12 with a blank on the league file. When you started your game, you know, it had the list of leagues there on the left-hand side, and one of them was blank. You know, it was because of that league file had gotten corrupted. So now that should be gone. Nope, still there. See, this bothers me. Let's try to get rid of that. So, created it. 
So something in League Manager, League 12, is a blank league name. Let's look at it. I don't see anything. Nothing looks out of the ordinary for me. It looks fine. I guess this is going to be one of those just inconveniences that you have to live with. Let's try it one more time. 